Nobody likes wars, well, except for the people who start them, because they desire some absolute outcome of power and goodness that never seems to happen. And World War II was yet again another unnecessary war that would strike most households with fear and poverty. Now I was sent out with a question. If Stalin and Hitler had not signed a non-aggression pact, would World War II have started over Poland? Well, it's complicated. First off, neither Stalin nor Hitler signed the non-aggression pact. The pact was actually signed by the German Foreign Minister Jochen von Ribbentrop and the Soviet Foreign Minister Vyacheslav Molotov. The Nazi-Soviet non-aggression pact was signed on August 23, 1939. This pact stated that if there were any disputes between two colonies, they would be settled diplomatically. The pact protected both countries from each other. It basically prevented any dispute that brought forth war. Most importantly, neither country could go to the aid of a country being attacked by the other. Prior to the signing of the pact, August 19, 1939 to be exact, both Joachim and Vyacheslav had signed an economic agreement pact. This pact stated that the Soviet Union would provide Germany with food supply. Russia would supply Germany of products that were imported from Poland, including grain, coal, lead, and zinc. These two packs were part of Germany's plan to take over Poland. The Nazis knew that if they attacked Polish allies, France and Great Britain would declare war, and they couldn't afford to go into a two-front war, which is why the pact was so important. Germany attacked Poland on September 1st, 1939. As planned, France and Great Britain declared war two days later, a motion that ignited World War II. If the non-aggression pact had not been signed, Russia would have aided Poland, making Germany fight a two-front war, which was something that Germany could not afford because of their fragile status from post-World War I. As a result, Germany would have not attacked Poland, postponing the war for another country to commence, knowing how easily tensions rise. Therefore, France and Britain would not have become part of the domino effect that was World War II, causing a momentary pause from the destruction that would come eventually. The fact that the Soviets sided with the Nazis before the war caused the Western powers to doubt the Soviets after the war. This led to the Cold War, but that was another subject.